welcome back to my channel. So I'm really excited for today's video. As you can tell, if you already subscribed to me, I am doing another apartment tour. Yes, I'm doing another one because so many people asked for this. My DMs, my email, everything was getting flooded with, can you do another apartment tour? And I know it's because not because of me. I know it's because a lot of people are moving to Dallas and you want to see what does Dallas have to offer. And honestly, Dallas has to offer a lot. Um, I actually already filmed this entire video, so it was an interesting video to film. There's a lot of things that I like about it. There are some things that I don't like about it. But if you're interested in learning more about this apartment, then stay tuned. This property is actually a two bedroom, two bath, and it goes for about $1,800. Um, for me, I think that's kind of expensive because there's a lot of apartments that you can find for 15, 16, even like 1700. But I wanted to give it a try because online, I really fell in love with this property. And I always wanna see if it lives up to its website i mean these websites are amazing the photos are amazing so i always come in person to see if it's really worth the hype obviously if i do move in here i would choose the one bedroom one bath and honestly i'm only doing this video because someone requested me to do this video i am actually going to end my apartment hunt in Dallas and I am moving somewhere else. And I'm not just moving to another city or another state, I'm actually moving to a different country and I'm moving very soon. And when I say soon, I mean like next month. <laughs> Okay, so honestly, I'm not too impressed with this apartment and there is a dead cockroach, dead cockroach. I feel like they definitely should have, I don't know, cleaned that up before touring this. I'm also confused by, um, I know that usually apartments put like blue tape whenever something needs like fixing or it's just like a place to like mark. I'm confused why there's like these all around right here right here right here i'm also very confused by the decor that they chose like this is like a literal sponge i don't know why they thought that this would be like the decoration and i know that you're not really here for that but i mean whoever the interior designer was for this like should get fired also these lights they give me very much like old hotel vibes and I do not like it but I do like this if you've seen any of my other videos you know that I like the um, tan granite situation I do like the floors the floors I'm a big fan of even though this is like that uh, wallpaper type floor it's like the super cheap floor and then it has a very nice big bathtub and shower head and then i do like it when they put this thing so i do like i do like that they put that cubby thing in there but if you're a girl you already know like that's not even tall enough to fit any of your shampoo bottles or any of that and my bathtub has like like the corners go out to like right here so i'm able to put stuff on the corners but this right here is like not big enough for anything and then this is only like that deep and not very tall so you would definitely need like a shower caddy these are the things that like i think of when i'm touring an apartment i don't know if anybody else thinks like this probably not closet in here is not very big at all um, i'm not sure if this is the master or the secondary but this is a king size bed and it fits really well so the rooms are pretty big um also that light just turned off because the model home has motion lights but the regular uh models do not so this is a king size bed and so then whenever you come out of here you come into the living room i do not like the decor and the colors that they chose in here like at all but you have you know pretty good space i mean definitely everything 
that you need and then it goes into the kitchen which we're gonna go into in a second out here is gonna be the balcony and the balcony is honestly really big this is about twice the size of my current um, balcony and I live in a two bedroom two bath right now I do like the landscape that they did throughout the property I feel like if you're only looking at this you could easily be like somewhere on vacation and then the view over there is not that nice I mean cables houses but if you just focus on this right here I love these trees if somebody knows what these trees are called please let me know I love those and they have them everywhere but this is such a cute area and they've really decorated the whole entire um, complex like this if you look like way back there these apartments are situated kind of in the middle of like i don't want to say nothing but definitely in an area where it's like heavily forested as you saw in the pool area there's a huge like forest right behind um, the apartment so i love that because i can like wake up and see some nature and then you're also like really really close to everything else so let's go back inside so this is the in unit washer and dryer most uh texas apartments come with washer and dryer so that's kind of like standard at this point but i've you know i've heard that the washing machines that don't have the thing in the middle don't actually wash as well is that true somebody let me know and then the laundry room right to the here is going to be the bathroom with the dead cockroach right there then over here is the kitchen um i am not personally a fan of these curved islands but that's just a personal preference again i don't like this decoration it like it just looks like someone from like 2005 decorated this i don't like it at all um you do have a good size pantry and then valet trash most apartments here do the valet trash where you can just like put it outside and they'll come and get it and then this is going to be a small coat closet i these motion lights are really i don't like the motion lights at all so then you come over here and you have your full size stove and microwave um again this decoration is terrible i feel like i would like the apartment more if it was just like empty big sink again i do love this color granite or quartz whatever this is um and then she did tell me that the two bedroom she did tell me that the two bedroom one comes with a double door whereas the one bedroom will just be like a single door then you come out and right here you have the i believe this is the master bedroom again this bed is also a king size bed so i mean the rooms are really really big and i love that there's a lot of natural lighting this window is huge from right here you have enough space for a nightstand king size bed a dresser and then another nightstand so this is the master bedroom bathroom usually in apartments like this especially at this price you'll get two vanities and a much larger bathroom i can kind of tell that they cut some corners here when building this and then usually an apartment for this price too you get a bathtub and a shower whereas here it's just the bathtub nothing else kind of weird that they put the towel rack right there but as you can see the bathroom is not that big it's literally just like the same size as the other bathroom and for this price because the two bedroom two bath is almost two thousand dollars for this price you can definitely find something that's way bigger and just as nice so toilet and then the closet is pretty big but i mean there's nothing like too crazy about it so my overall thoughts on this apartment is that they're honestly like pretty basic for what it is i feel like you can definitely get something just like this for a better price and more space i actually had the opportunity to help somebody that watched my previous video and they needed help with moving to dallas and i helped them find an apartment it's not something that i do full time i'm not a leasing agent i've just lived here my whole entire life i know dallas like the back of my hand and i 
just am really good at finding apartments. So this is something that I enjoy doing. If you also need help, um, feel free to email me. I'll be more than happy to help you. Um, I actually helped her and two other people find apartments. I found one of them a very similar apartment to this in Allen because she is a woman with a family and she wants a place where the schools are really good. I found them a two bedroom, two bathroom apartment just like this, if not better for $1,300 a month. Um, that does not include utilities and it does depend on the unit that she ends up choosing, but that's the one that I recommended to her. This one right here is going to be about $1,800. At this property, actually the one bedroom is $1,300. So if you go by my recommendations, you would be saving about $500. Um, but overall, I, really enjoy touring these apartments for you guys because so many people asked um this property is actually in carrollton i would say this area is not as nice as the other areas that i found cheaper apartments but somebody asked me to look in carrollton and frisco so that's what i'm doing overall i will just say that these apartments are really really good at taking pictures they'll hire good photographers they'll have whole photo shoots for their apartments their websites look amazing they're professional and then you come here and there's a cockroach in the bathroom and the floor is peeling and the lights won't turn on and the decoration is awful and you just realize that it's not worth it so i would recommend always 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 tour a property in person before you commit to it always it's just like buying a house a car i would never buy either of those without ever coming to see it first and I know a lot of people can't do that because they're coming from out of state, out of town, and they maybe don't have the time or the flexibility to do that. So I thoroughly enjoy making these videos and I'll be more than happy to do it for you. So with that being said, if you enjoyed today's video, please like, comment, subscribe, and let me know what you think about this apartment. Do you think it's worth it? I know a lot of you, hold on, my arm is tired. <laughs> my arm is tired. I know a lot of you are coming from like New York, upstate, east coast, west coast, and you're like, oh my god, for a thousand dollars, that's such a good price. No, no, it's not because you cannot compare, you can't compare the prices of like New Jersey to Dallas. No, like the whole point why people move here is to save money. So don't get scammed, do your research, find the best apartment, and good luck. If you're moving to Dallas, I hope you love it. I actually am moving out of Dallas. By the time that this video goes up, I will probably be living in a different country. So, I mean, if you're interested in following me in that journey, also comment below what country you think I'm moving to and subscribe so you can be part of the journey. Okay. My arm is literally like about to fall off, but this was so fun to make. I really enjoy, uh, this was so fun to make. I really enjoy making these videos. If you enjoyed today's video, please subscribe so that you can see my face again sometime on the internet. And yeah, until next time.